is uh, Paul from Poland. Uh, his speech is dedicated to supply chain. And Paul, please feel free to start. Okay, hello everyone. One moment, please. Mm, can you hear me good? Yes, uh, we can hear you. We see you. Okay, uh, good morning, uh, dear guests and fellow innovators of the uh, forestry sector. My name is Paul Boyarski and I'm CEO at Forsyth. Uh, today, I'm thrilled to share with you a revolution harness is the power of artificial intelligence and enhancing efficiency of supply chains in our industry. So, um, first of all, mm, uh, I, uh, uh, was, uh, in, uh, forest industry for a few years and I, uh, faced, uh, in our industry, uh, just a few, oh, I'm so sorry. So I faced, uh, a few moments in our industry, uh, particularly in area of timber measurement. The shortcomings of traditional methods are not just operational hurdles. They represent a significant barrier to sustainability and profitability. At Foresight, our vision has been to develop a solution that not only addresses these challenges, but also paves the way for a new era in forestry management. In the traditional context, Timber measurement uh, has been labor intensive, prone to error, and inconsistent. Recognizing these challenges, I'm so sorry, we at Forsyth have developed an AI driven solution that transcends these limitations. Our technology employs sophisticated algorithms capable of analyzing uh, timber volumes and diameters with unprecedented precision, thereby transforming a once cumbersome process into a streamlined data-driven operation. So how can you see uh, all uh, is needed to our artificial intelligence solution is taking a photo, app analyzing, receiving result, and exporting data to your storage models. Not only yours, but you understand me. So what are the key challenges? Consider the traditional scenario. Manual measurements are slow, often inaccurate, and subject to human error. Laser meters, while an improvement uh, still carries significant, significant limitations in terms of cost and measurement errors. Uh, same for weighing, xylometry, and other meters. These inefficiencies result in substantial financial losses and resource vestige, issues that are unsuitable both economically and env environmentally. So how can you see uh, below our solution is uh, measuring uh, these logs and volumes. So what are the strategies and solutions? At Foresize, we have embraced the strategy, strategy uh, that centers on real-time data processing powered by AI. This approach is not merely an incremental improvement. It's a completely overall of the measurement process. Our app provides instant, reliable results, dramatically improving measurement accuracy. This innovation is a testament to our commitment to technology advancement and industry leadership. So uh, let's look at some real world results. So uh, we tested uh, our application in a lot of areas. And here's just a result of one of them. We improved uh, the speed of measurement and accuracy a lot. So the speed was higher in 10 times and accuracy kept the uh, same as uh, 
properly made uh, manual measurement. Uh, let's talk about future trends in timber measurement. As we look to the future, it's clear that the intersection of technology and forestry is fertile ground for innovation. The application of predictive analytics and machine learning in timber measurement is not just a passing trend. It's a foundation for a more sustainable, profitable, and environmentally responsible industry. For size is at the forefront of this transformation, setting new standards for what's possible. Implementing for size innovation. Integrating for size into your operation is a straightforward process. We have designed our solution to be user friendly, easily adoptable, and supported by a comprehensive implementation program. Whether you are facing logistical, technical, or adoption challenges, our team is ready to assist, ensuring a seamless transition to this advanced measurement method. In conclusion, uh, FOSIS represents more than just a technolo technological solution. It embodies a commitment to advancing our industry through innovation and sustainability. I want to thank you all for the attention and interest. And I want to all that I hear every day that our industry is very slow changing, very slow moving. And uh, my project and uh, projects of my colleagues and uh, other people are just here to demonstrate that it's not true and to, together we can change this industry and make uh, a final step to the industry 4.0 and uh, finally made this industry uh, very comfortable to use and to work in here is my contacts and if you need to contact me i will be glad to speak with you after this conference okay thank you paul for your presentation and you got the first question uh i don't know from where but uh, you can see in the chat that this question is about estonia so if you open the chat could you please comment this question okay okay I, I i'm trying i'm trying one moment please yeah, so actually the first question is uh, about your difference, if you know uh, Tim Better Solution uh, measurement app from Estonia, uh, which has been developed uh, maybe four, many years ago. And what's the difference between uh, your solution and Tim Better? That's question from Marek Hirs. Okay, that's a very nice question. First of all, uh, we di uh, differ in... Uh some moments that our technology was built uh, a bit later and we are using a bit more innovative technologies so also we uh, our goal was to build uh, a more accessible and affordable solution so we made it uh, the maximum easy to use uh, the cheapest solution uh, on the market and also we are improving our accuracy all the time. So uh, according to all of these points, we also can add uh, flexibility of our application so we can integrate with every solution. And uh, mm, also I would add here that our solution specifies on some kind of uh, programs that can integrate with our solution and our solution is as a tool with uh, these uh, programs like storage models, uh, automating chain supply systems and other. Okay, and maybe uh, as you said about your uh, data storage, there is a question from uh, Garrett now uh, about uh, 
real use case uh, in the forest when there yeah, is yeah. no proper uh, connectivity and poor network connection does your app uh, work uh, can you know uh, app work uh, offline and if uh, synchronization is available later or how it works you know uh, yeah. offline mm -hmm. with poor network connection and how your data can be synchronized uh, later mm -hmm. Uh, that's the other moment uh, which differs us from our competitors. And uh, yes, we work without uh, internet. Our algorithms are built uh, without using cloud um, calculating or something else. All is done on the mobile device. You just need to make your measures. And uh, when you get to the internet or Wi-Fi, you just... Uh, uh, make your data export it to your storage models and other software where you need this data. Okay, thank you for your question, uh, for your answer. And I see uh, other questions. Uh, we have to uh, jump to other panelists, and uh, then we will consider all the questions. So don't think that we uh, we ignore them. So thank you, Paul, for your presentation.